A new school for 900 Berkeley County elementary students will soon be built in the Hanahan area. Yeah, tonight, News 2's Matt Elba attended a meeting in Goose Creek where parents and students got a first look at the site plan for the new building. But now some people are saying they're not happy with the location, right, Matt? Yeah, that's right, guys. Some people are saying the new school might be too small, and others say the site of the school is going to cause traffic in the area. Now a new one will cause more traffic that's back and forth, back and forth. That's it. I don't need it. Willie Barnett says he's lived on Williams Lane in Hanahan for 64 years. We got a nice peaceful life. We've been living there all our years. We don't need that stuff around there. We don't need that. And Willie thinks the new school will be a traffic nightmare with only one way in and out off his street. I don't want it. I don't want that. After much debate about where to build the school, back in October, the Berkeley County School District and Hanahan City Council agreed on Williams Lane. Dozens attended a community meeting Tuesday night to get the first glimpse at what the school will look like, the school's floor plans, and bus lanes and school pickup locations as they were unveiled to parents. I think they need a third floor because the area is already growing and it's only going to get bigger. Parents were able to ask the architects of the school and Berkeley County School District officials questions about the new design for the 22,110,000 square foot school. Architects and district officials say Williams Lane will be widened during the construction, which is set to begin next fall. They're also considering another entrance off Rhett Avenue. Fall this year, we're going to have breaking ground and trees down and on our way. For parents like Tammy Sakalis, who have been campaigning to get the school built for months, they're just glad it's finally happening. I don't know why there's any more of an argument. Like, there's going to be a school built, and I'm excited. I just want to know what side the sidewalk's going on and where the crosswalks are, and I'm happy. Officials say a traffic study will be done over the next month before any construction begins. We'll have more on the new school's developments in the coming months. Live in the studio, Matt Alba, News 2.